All right, guys, as we get started, I want to go ahead and uh, open up forms.google.com. A lot of people go over to drive.google.com, which is uh, another way to do it. Uh, that gives you your entire suite of the Google applications. I like forms because it starts me out with some very uh, unique things. So, for example, you can say I can start a new form from some different templates here. Uh, also, it gives me my most recent form, so if I'm working on something, I could quickly get to those things. Uh, just overall, a lot more convenient. We're going to get started with a blank form. And uh, as you know, from here, you'll go ahead and give this thing a title. Let's just call this Ask a Demonstration. We'll come back to this. It always starts us off with one question. So we're really skipping over all the beginning stuff. Today is about advanced. So one of our first uh, tips for today is uh, dropping in a list of things. So for example, one of the things that's kind of common in some surveys is what state are you from? All right. So this is uh, right now it's giving me short answer, but uh, I think what we'll do is we'll make this a drop down. And from here, um, I don't want to have to start typing in all 50 states. So our first trick today is just copying and pasting. I don't know if you know this or not, but look at this. I'm going to a website here that just happens to have all 50 states listed. I'm just going to grab those, copy it, come back here to Google Forms, and we're going to paste them in. There you go. So uh, this works uh, with any list, whether you get it from Microsoft Word, from Excel. Let's try another one. So uh, let's add a question. Who is your advisor? All right. So uh, instead of multiple choice, yeah, I guess we could leave it as multiple choice. I'm going to go ahead and let's go over here to Microsoft Word. I just happen to have a few names handy. So this is Microsoft Word now. And we're back here. Going to tab over and paste. So there you go. A big time saver. 